How are you, my friends? Uh, my name is Sergi. I'm a portrait photographer in Greenville, South Carolina. And today I wanted to, to do some more pictures for my boy, Marcik. And today I want to do some portraits, kind of giving him freedom, kind of freedom pictures. So basically, completely lifestyle portraits for the mark. So we're gonna let him to do whatever he wanna do. I'm just gonna be capturing uh, some interesting moments. And actually, I recommend for photographers to do that for the kids. That way, kids gonna have, uh, the kids gonna enjoy more of the photo shoots. They're gonna be less cranky. They're more gonna be cooperative. Basically, uh, you're just gonna go and hunt for him for the for the portraits. So, Marcik, you ready? You ready? <laughs> you ready to go? Okay, so we're gonna start taking some nice porches and I'm gonna be in the same time explaining what I'm doing and maybe commenting something. Okay, so we have here kind of cool logs. This kind of outfit probably gonna nicely work right here. I wanted him to kind of play with these logs and we watch and see what we're gonna capture. It is, right? Let's see. So. I'm gonna try to put him right here. Maybe like sit here. Okay, he's really, oh, oh. The light right now is coming from kind of from the trees. Most of the location right here, we have forest. <laughs> so, oh, he's shy. It's actually a good thing for me right now because that way he's gonna give me some interesting shots. Gonna take some first image. I'm gonna, so I forgot about to explain about my camera I'm using right now 85 millimeter uh, lens it's a RF and Canon ES R5 camera I love shooting at 1.2 that's my style for kids for families and if you guys did not didn't know how I shoot at 1.2 I have a video so it's gonna be on the comments or in the link so check it out if you did not yet watch that video how I shoot one at 1.2 families and portraits go ahead and check it out but after this video all right all right, let's take some pictures because he already giving some nice looks. Look at this. This logs look so cool for him. Right, Marchik? Oh, I like this moment. It's kind of... And I'm using right now settings at 180 shutter speed, f1.2 in ISO 100. Okay, look at this. He just do his things. Gonna do some vertical shot here. Nice. Yeah, hit it this moment. Beautiful. This is it. Just let the kid, just let the kid to do something. And you just capture. You just go for different angles. Now I'm gonna do this woods behind him. There's interesting woods. Look at that. Sometimes I do some kind of interesting or awkward sounds to make his eye connection to me if I wanted to capture his eyes. But you usually are gonna have only one second. So you basically, whenever you do the sound, you have to be ready to click it or you're gonna miss it. Okay, I'm gonna try to move the log because it's blocking the, his legs because I like the perspective of the woods. Yeah, let's see here. See, that's what happened. Actually, he gave me two seconds, but I made it three shots. Huh. And this looks amazing. Look at this, my friends. If the child calm, not making some awkward noises or something, then it's a good time to get a little bit closer and do some headshots. So, uh, I get closer a little bit to get some closer shots, right, Marchik? Oh, you're such a cutie boy. <gasps> See, only one second, one second. And I got three shots, and look at this, what is looking around. So one shot, he's looking down. Then he's looking directly in the camera, and that's when I create the sound.
in, right away his eyes go somewhere else. Basically, you need to be ready. And that's a lot of photographers missing. They usually do the sound and then they pick it up the camera and the child already looking completely different location. So before you do any sounds for the children, you need to be ready to click. <sighs> looks so beautiful. He looks like enjoying this beautiful day. Look at that. The logs looks really nice with him. Right, Marcik? <gasps> He's shy today. No way, Marcik, what happened? You usually run across. Oh, you find something. Oh, there's some bird. What it's called? Feather. <laughs> some bird feather. He finds some bird feather here. Oh, okay, look at that. See? Sometimes you just give it to kid. Enjoy and play. Relax. Don't force kid to any pose that you, you, you're thinking. Because especially he's right now one year and a half. And at that age, they have only a couple seconds attention. So it's the best way just to let him to do whatever he do. And you just run behind him, kind of like a hunter. <laughs> he looks like really like the logs. He's not even walk away. Okay, you know what? I kind of like this pile of the logs. This looks so cool. Marcik, let's go. Hmm? Oh, let's go here. Let's stay here. What is that, Mark? Okay, this log is interesting. He really liked that tree. Okay, let's see. Nice. Waiting for the moment is interesting. And always camera has to be ready. Oh. Yep. Okay, now I have to pull ice a little bit higher. It's getting darker. And there is lower light. So I'm right now at 320 ISO to pull my shutter speed at 100. Mm -hmm. Okay, gotta go far away to get more for background interesting. You have to sometimes step down. And I like to shoot from a little bit lower ground, from lower position, especially kids. Or, or to be in the same level as them, as their heads. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna grab him, feel the lug. He's like a holding. Hold it. Mm -hmm. Hold it one more. One more, Marchik. Hold it one more. <laughs> he's, he's playing. Mm -hmm. Hold it. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. He's putting down. Look at that shot. Mm -hmm. Hold it. Stay, stay. Okay, like that. Hold it. I got it. Marching. <laughs> you bring him some wood to home. We're gonna do some barbecue, right? Cutie. Mm -hmm. Nice. Nice. He's putting down. That's it. Well done. He's putting back like a gentleman. That's it. Good job. <laughs> we made it. Sometimes you wanted to change location and perspective of oh, some kind of car come. Something, he saw something. Yay, oh. Nice. All right, I still capturing the moment. See you guys? Give him something to do. Yeah, and he's gonna put it back. Opa.
Good boy, good boy. Oops, gonna fall. Well done. Woo. Got it. That's it. <laughs> We have a cat right here, friend. And the mark, I think is gonna be awesome. Final images, cat and mark. It's like he's playing down there. Let's see. Gonna watch and wait for the moment, interesting. All right, beautiful. Look at these shots. The cat come on top. Okay. Wow, look at this. Woo! So lovely shots here. Sometimes, cats, it's really awesome addition. <laughs> All right, yeah, a few more moments. Nice. Come on, come on. <laughs> oh, that's good. We got some shots. All right, guys, we just finished it. Photo shoot with the mark, little. So uh, in this amazing kind of background log that we have here. Uh, so that's how I usually work with the kids. Not just my kids, but I work the like, same way with the client's kids. So friends, if you like this video, how it's turned out, and it's helpful for you guys. So I would ask you to like this video, comment, and recommend for your friends. Yeah, see, he told you. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and we'll see you guys at the next video. Bye. Magic, say bye. 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 <laughs>